what's going on? Kyle Chan here and welcome back to my February edition of Sustain the Industry where I publicly do my part to help the anime industry by purchasing anime merchandise and hopefully inspiring you guys to do the same. So this month I didn't get all that much stuff. I didn't even get my so-called normal amount of manga pickups, but I did get a good amount so let's get right into the good stuff. So we're going to start off with the manga pickups as usual. We have Bakuman Volume 7. Next up, Bakuman Volume 8, and Bakuman Volume 9. Then we got some Bleach. We got Bleach Volume 36, and Bleach Volume 37. Bleach and I had a little falling out over the anime, so now I'm slowly collecting the manga, because the manga is much better than the anime, because the anime has such ridiculous filler arcs. So, that's why I'm getting the manga really good go pick it up next we have one piece we got one piece volume 17 volume 24 volume 28 volume 29 volume 30 volume 31 volume 32 Volume 46, Volume 48, and Volume 53. So that filled in a pretty huge gap in my One Piece collection. Next pile, we got Mal Juvenile Remix Volume 2. I'm really looking forward to checking out this volume because the first volume was really good. So if you guys are interested in psychological thrillers, this is a series for you. Next up, we got Blue Exorcist of Volume 4, Volume 5, and Volume 6. I completed the anime not too long ago, and now I'm going to read the manga. It's pretty much the same as far as I know, so I'm just going to read it because I love the anime so much. Next up, we have Naruto Volume 54. Next up, we have Sailor Moon Volume 3. Absolutely love Sailor Moon. Gotta check this series out. Next, we got High School of the Dead Volume 5. Yu-Gi-Oh! GX Volume 8. Then we got XXX Holic or Holic Volume 17. As well as Volume 18. Next up, we have Dengeki Daisy, Volume 6, Volume 7, and Volume 8. And the last manga series that I picked up this month is Alice 19. I got Volume 2, Volume 3, Volume 4, Volume 6, and volume seven. I'm up to volume six so far. This series is really good. If you like Shoujo, I definitely recommend you guys check that one out. Moving on to the anime pickups. The first one is Gundam Sea Destiny Collection One, as well as Collection Two. I gotta say one thing about Gundam Sea Destiny. Mind fuck. I mean, absolutely crazy, absolutely awesome. If you like Gundam, Definitely check out Destiny, definitely check out Seed, really good. That's all I can really say without spoiling everything for you. I totally thought I had this figured out, that was not the case at all. The second part really just blew me out of the water, so definitely check out Destiny. Next up, we have Amai Buddha, the complete collection. And the last pickup of the month is Yamana's first time, the limited release box set. I'm really looking forward to checking this out. It seems a little perverted, but you can be wrong about the perverted anime series because I didn't think I was going to like, um, what was that other series? Uh, Heaven's Lost Prophecy. I didn't think I was going to like that series, but I absolutely loved it. So I'm going to go into it with the same mindset and I'm sure I'm going to like this one as well. So that is all the pickups. Let's get into the receipts. I know you guys love receipts. Anyway, 
So the first receipt is for your mom's first time, and I got that for forty-one dollars and it's seventy-four cents. Next up, right stuff. Now Juvenile Remix was $9.99. Okay, you're going to notice that some of these were not, you know, paid. That's because uh, Barnes & Noble is having a buy three, get a fourth one free deal this month, so I got like nine free volumes, so there you go. All volumes, prices, and the last receipt. So that is everything that I got in the month of February. Before I go, I just have one question for you guys. What are you doing to sustain the anime industry? See you guys next month.